This is additive color. The additive primaries are red, green, and blue. I've marked them in such a way that the colors are written here. Red is 100, zero, zero, green is 010, zero, zero, and blue is 001. I'm using 0 to 1 space to represent what you normally think of as 0 to 255 in 8-bit Photoshop. But I'm using 1s in this case. Uh, the way that additive color works is the uh, primaries add together. So if we make this have the linear dodge or add blend mode, and this have the linear dodge or add blend mode, and we do the same with the third color, then we can take these and add them together. Red and green make yellow. You can see one, one, zero. Red and blue make magenta, one, zero, one. Green and blue make cyan, zero, one, one. And if we add them all together, we get white. 1, 1, 1, and a full color image. These are the subtractive color primaries, cyan, magenta, and yellow. I've marked them in such a way that you can identify them by putting a white circle over the uh, color separations that exist in this, in this uh, example. Um, cyan contains no red, but it contains green and blue. Magenta contains no green, but it contains red and blue. Yellow contains no blue, but it contains red and green. If we want to combine these uh, subtractive colors, we need to use the, um, this may surprise you since it's called subtractive, but we use the multiply blend mode. Multiply, set this to multiply, and we set this to multiply. Uh, this is because what we call subtractive is really uh, mimicking how a color transparency works if you sandwich them together where white is clear and the uh, color is like a colored filter like a cellophane or some sort of a gel. So if we take cyan and magenta and multiply them, you can see they combine to make blue and blue is the only surviving white dot here. If we take cyan and yellow and combine them, we get green, as is indicated here by the white dot. If we take magenta and yellow and combine them, we get red. There's the white dot. And if we take the red and the cyan and combine them, when all colors line up, they make black and a full color image.